Oh, what? <laughs> Sorry. I thought you went up. Ah, <laughs> oh, you're covered in mud. You'll have to excuse me. Um, today I'm DIYing. I'm uh, putting new decking down and uh, gravel in the back garden, stuff like that. Ah, <laughs> right in my neck. Uh, and too sore. Ouch. So I'm, I'm out and about and I'm, I'm this state of me, uh, knackered. But I thought I'd come in and just, uh, I'm, I'm going to start this video off just now. Um, and I'll, I'll come back to it in a couple of days. Uh, but basically, uh, vaporfreak.de, uh, uh, the link will be sure, somewhere about here. Uh, they sent me, uh, I was talking away to them, and uh, they said, have you tried these uh, long barrel atties that we've got in? Uh, no, I said, so next order they would chuck a couple in for me. So they did. Uh, and it's, I'm sure it's Panara. Panara series they're called. Uh, it's 1.5 ohm resistance. And this is what I've had, uh, I've been vaping on most of the day, is this wee guy here. Um, I've got a, a wide bore drip tip there on the top, and it's just my little 350 eagle. Um, I've got another eagle there that I've been swapping between. Uh, you know, rather than using one of my good mods, I've just been using this. Now that's a uh, scope. Uh, I've mentioned him before, Scope, uh, he does some e-liquid and um, that's his, the peach that he sent me a while ago. And do you know, there's, there's something about a, a dripping atty. It is, I, I've said this before, I'll say it again, it's, the taste is just out of this world. Now my last encounter with uh, a dripping atty like this was uh, the HH. Uh, three five three five seven, and it was a short barrel, and yes, I hated it, and yes, I got a lot of flack for that one. Um, maybe if I'd gone for the long barrel, it would have been a different story. But this, uh, I mean, I've got another one here. Um, I'll just show you up close. Well, there's not really a lot to show you. I mean, it's. It's a bridged, you know, it's not bridgeless, it's got a bridge on it. Um, that looks like a 1.8. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything down there. Just glimpse it in no more. Um, you know, it's, I mean, if you know your dripping at is, then uh, there's not really a lot to tell you here. Other than for the past five hours, I've been chugging away in this, and the taste is just lovely. And I'm getting four drips in a go, and it's not flooding uh, or anything. I'm not having any problems with it. It's just a great vape. <laughs> Listen, the, these guys are selling these things for, for €7.90. Uh, what is that, six quid or something like that? I'm not sure. The, these things can, I don't know about this one, but they can last for a long, long time. Uh, I know the HH357 that I gave to, well, I did a trade with uh, Cooper uh, donkeys ago. He's still using it, and it's going great guns, apparently. Um, so I'll stop this here. I'll go off, and I'll come back in a couple of days, uh, because I'll continue vaping with this, and I'll let you know how I get on. Looking a little bit more uh, dressed. Um, <laughs> 
So I just got some vape mail here, so uh, I'm just unpacking it. Uh, still going on this. Um, I'm now sporting, and it's lush. Look at that. Um, is that a shot? That is a, gla a glass blown drip tip. It is stunning. I've got a few of them here and I'll do a, a little video. Uh, it came from Envision Vapor. But uh, Scope, uh, you know, Scope, uh, get them in UK Vapors and a couple of other forums. Uh, he just sent me some of his berry mix. You can probably notice that I'm not really too bothered about doing a full-on professional review here. Uh, this is just a little diary, if you like. So, back in the Panara. Uh, which is... You can see the vapor and the drip tip. That's so cool. Mm. Listen, I know I'm probably rambling on yet again, but if you want to really, really taste your juice, these wee things are just ideal you know if i know there's a few folk out there that do nothing but drip with these i i don't have the patience personally for just sitting with nothing but this um if i was in the living room or here in the shed or just chilling out then fine yeah uh, but to actually have it as an old av not for me I'm just going to stop this here because I mean it's getting into the realms of just talking too much about something that's actually very very simple. Um, I would honestly, if you've not tried a drippinati, seriously give it a bash. I, I, it doesn't even have to be one of these. Uh, these are very good. Don't get me wrong, they are very good. Uh, be great in a UFS or something like that. Uh, dripping on its own. I mean, I know where a lot of folk are into rebuildable dripping atomizers, but don't forget these wee guys. They're just... Mm, I'm doing a Bishop Peels here. <coughs> Sorry, Bish. Wasn't taking the piss or anything there, mate. Uh, so, that's me. Uh, thanks to uh, Vapor Freak for sending them on. Thoroughly enjoying them. Uh, thanks to Scope for sending them on and uh, the juice on. It's beautiful. Again, uh, prefer the peach. Funnily enough, I prefer the peach, uh, and I don't like peach normally. Go figure. Uh, that's it. Uh, done for today. Uh, we'll catch up with you soon, and uh, that's it. All the best. Bye.